vegetables for you. So we're now getting oxtail. Sarap yun sa sofa. Galing lang, may katabi akong vlogger. Ito, ayun. Hot sabaw. Satwa Dubai. Satwa is the oldest, one of the oldest parts of Dubai and it's one of the most populous. You can see lots of nationalities here, Filipinos, Indians, Pakistanis, name it, they have it. The locals are here and we have been invited to attend uh, an event by Jumeirah Rotana Hotel because for the first time their restaurant Olive Oil is hosting a Filipino brunch. Uh, I think they're launching it today, so we'll see what Filipino food we have. We're so excited to eat Filipino food once again after being away from Dubai for two weeks because we just got home from Armenia and Georgia. So come on, let's eat. It's almost lunchtime and I'm kind of hungry. Maraming beses na kitang nilayasan Iniwanan na ibang pinuntahan we are now here at Olive Oil and see we have a Manila here. Olive Oil, the old day dining. Looks like home. I think we arrived early, it's around 12 o'clock, so uh, our host Moana told us that usually guests arrive here at around 1, maybe they made the most out of the Thursday night, or you can just rest, relax, maybe drink, have fun with friends. So since we're here early and we can make uh, the most of the time here, you can check out the food that's being served, actually the buffet is ready. So let's see what Filipino dishes they have here. First we have the soup, of course rice, pancit, which is the food that we got from Chinese people. Oh, we have stuffed squid. It's not so good. And then milaga, bunpok, bunpok, yeah? Buntot in Filipino means tail, and this one is oxtail. Pakbet. Pakbet is an Ilocos dish. Uh, Ilocos is from the northern Philippines, and they love uh, to have vegetables and then some shrimp paste in it. And then, ginataang alimango. Ginataan, gata means coconut, uh, coconut milk. And here, we love serving uh, seafood like crabs. Alimango is crabs with coconut milk. It's like brining. Creamy because of the coconut milk. Really tastes so good. You should try that one if you're not familiar with Filipino food. And then, aside from the usual Filipino dishes, we actually have the other Asian variety like sushi, uh, makis, and there's tempura. And then, of course, what's this? Let's check this out. Oh, I think this is the Omani. It's like chocolate pudding. And some sweets, some cakes, some fruits. And one more important thing, they actually serve alcohol. We are now trying out the cocktail of the day here at Olive Oil Filipino Brunch. It's called Las Islas. So the mix is vodka, there's another one. And then fruits, tropical fruits, which are endemic in the Philippines. And the taste is so good. Uh, Jed really prepared a really nice cocktail, so refreshing. It feels like, yeah, you're in a tropical island, you're not in the Middle East. So it brings back memories of being in the Philippines, of just drinking the beach. 
and just having fun with your friends, hanging out somewhere, like just having the simple life in the Philippines, but a simple life but full of flavors. Okay. Round is a Filipino band, Parokya ni Edgar. Uh, Parokya ni Edgar is a much loved band in the Philippines. They're like a household name. And having it played while you're having brunch here makes you feel like you're actually almost in the Philippines. Nice touch. We are so happy that we got reunited with our fellow bloggers. Although Ed is kidding me about being a blogger. <laughs> so this, uh, this is Ed. Husband of Lady, of Lady and her sweetest cakes, Rax and I, uh, I, then let's go to the, the super friends, that's Lady, and Lady and her sweetest cakes, Ayan, voidabai.com, and here's what's gonna make us all happy today. <laughs> Nakita ko sa bay kinuha ko yung box from outer space. So we have an interview with Ed, Abby, and Ayan Gonzaga. <laughs> <laughs> in Pyong, Shanghai, which is like a spring roll, our version of spring roll. And then as I said earlier, longanisa, which is our version of chorizo, I think we got it from the Spanish. So I forgot to review the longanisa. <laughs> this is the last slice I have. Uh, as I was telling, there are like different kinds of longanisas in the Philippines. The ones I've tasted. He's blogging your blog. He's blogging my blog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, so there are different kinds of langanisas in the Philippines. The ones that we've tasted are the ones in Pampanga, which uh, is the place I'm from. It's kind of sweet. And then the one in Vigan, which is in the northern part of the Philippines, which is garlicky. Now, this one we have here is like a cross, a cross between the two. It has that garlicky flavor. It's kind of sweet as well. Can I buy with butter? Can I buy with butter? <laughs> Wow, it's so creative, yeah? I'm now in my mains. I got the buntot, which is oxtail, and then lomi, which is a Filipino favorite. It's like noodle soup with thick noodles. And I have the crab with uh, coconut milk, and then the stuffed squid, fried chicken, pakbet, which is an Ilocano. Uh, food and then of course rice. Filipinos can't live without rice. Some might, might try when they're dieting, but no, they always go back. And uh, yeah, that's it. Let's see. Price for the brunch here, the Filipino brunch here. It's just 50 dirhams, so that equates around maybe around 12 dollars. And then if you add, I think, around 60 dirhams or 59, something like that, you get unlimited. I think it's the place to be, especially the area is just in Satwa. So there are like lots of Filipinos living here and in the nearby areas of Dubai, like Karama, uh, or Dubai, those places, Deira. So it's so easy to come here. The ambience is really, really nice. Just had, um, we finished our brunch. We finished our Filipino brunch here at the Jumeirah Rotana Olive Oil. And overall, wow, that was amazing. The food was really good. The ambience is amazing. And then the music, everything feels Filipino. Yeah. And uh, for all Filipinos out there and for all those who want to experience Filipino food, I think this is one of the best places to try at Olive Oil. 
the mirror banner and it's only like uh, an alcohol is available so you better try it, it is really good